In today's video, we're opening up a mystery Yu-Gi-Oh box from EX Gamer Part 2. What's up guys, we're back with another mystery box opening from EX Gamer. The summer of EX Gamer continues. We're on to box number two that he sent us. He sent us four last year. We've already opened one this year. It's pretty amazing. We opened Ruxin 1.0 versus Ruxin 2.0 packs. Go check out that video. It was super fun to open those and revisit. I'm really curious to see what he sent in box two because like I was shocked. I was like, oh wow, Ruxin packs. This is kind of interesting. So I'm interested to see like if he just sent like regular packs this time or if he did something else creative like that. Okay, I got the box open. There's a lot of stuff in here. So we have Special Event 2 right here. Let's see what it says. Ruxin, this is an intervention challenge. We are here for you, Ruxin. This has been going for too long. It's time we confront the pack that gives you the most struggle in a particular 10. In a box, you'll find the packs. The rest of the other packs are bonus to have fun with. Okay, what is the pack that we struggle with the most? Hmm, there's a lot that we've struggled with. So I'm interested to see what he thinks the most struggle is. Let's just get into it and find out. We have a giveaway today. So if you're interested in the giveaway, just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know down below. What do you think about EX Gamer sending us all this awesome content to be opened up. Make sure to tell him that he is a legend and also tell him that he is also a weirdo. Just, just let him know in the comments. EX Gamer, be respectful though. Be respectful, but not too respectful. All right, no, I'm just kidding. Let's go, EX Gamer. You are actually a legend. Let's see what you're giving away, man. The Elemental Hero Wild Heart Miss. Didn't he give this away last time? He must have had a few of these. We have the access code. That's nice. And then a Magnificent Mavens. I feel like, is this the same giveaway? I mean, either way, it's an awesome giveaway, but I feel like he did this last time. He didn't give away the exact same giveaway. Last time he had a fin rear instead of an access code. So that makes sense. Actually still a really awesome giveaway and pretty funny that it's like so uniform. All right, after much deliberation, I think, okay, so he said there's this particular pack from a tin that we struggle with. So the tin is a Cyber Dragon Sealed tin, 2006. This is not a cheap tin. This is a really, really fun tin. One of my favorites ever. I assume that he is talking about, well, actually now I think he's probably talking about Shadow Infinity, but he could also be talking about Cybernetic Revolution. Then he also sent us a box full of packs. This is not Photon Hibernova, by the way. This is old school GX packs like Elemental Energy, The Lost Millennium, and then he has more Elemental Energy and then Cybernetic Revolution, which is why I was thinking Cybernetic Revolution earlier, but now I'm not too sure. So all I know is that we have struggled with a lot of these packs and EX Gamer could potentially solve that problem today. And not only that, he sent us a ton of Clash of Rebellion special editions. So we're probably gonna open a couple of these and then all of these and then this, and then probably save the others for another video. Cause I'm still stockpiling his extra stuff he sent to like make a whole other video, maybe even do a live stream, like EX Gamer live stream or something like that. So we're gonna open like one or two of these and then save the rest for a future video, which should be pretty fun. Maybe we'll pull the Red Ice Flare Metal, which we've never pulled. So this is one we've struggled with as well. So I thought he might be talking about this too. Okay, so uh, EX Gamer, this is a this is a crazy opening. Like he has sent some good stuff these last couple, uh, last couple of videos. So we have Fright for Tiger and Destruction Sword Flash. Very cool. Super rares. So I am hoping that we can pull him something really awesome like we did last year. We pulled that Ancient Fairy Dragon, which was pretty awesome. And this year I would love to pull him a Red Eyes Flare Metal. Maybe an Ultimate Rare GX card would be really cool. We have Performer Pal, Drummerilla, Ignite Square, Secret Blast, Backup Rider. We have Retaliating C, Form H Hat Tricker. Where's the foil in this? Camelumped. Man Dragon. I don't remember if it's at the end or if it's right before the rare. I feel like it might be before the rare, but I guess we'll find out in our first foil, maybe. Hopefully we get one in our six packs. We have had some error packs out of this set before, which was pretty amazing. So if we could do that again, it'd be really cool. We had an uh, ulti and a secret in a couple of packs. That was pretty insane. We have Raidraptor Fuzzy Lanius. I used this when we did a Master Duel series that I did one episode of, and I like opened packs and had to duel with them. We used Raid Raptor and Fuzzy Lanius was one of our best cards. Before Mage Trick Clown, if you haven't seen that, I think I have a playlist. You can go check it out. But the Master Duel videos just never did that well, so I never really brought them back. But they were fun to make, though. A little bit of a change up. Black Metal Dragon. We have a Flame Eater. <laughs> he looks like the Chain Chomp with a hat on. Uh, Trick Clown. Fuzzy Lanius again. Brilliant Spark. Rank up Magic Raptors for us. We have the Blowtorch. Cosmo Forerunner, and oh, okay, it's just a bunch of prayers and commons there. Let's go into our GX packs. Let's see if we can get anything crazy here. Where did he get all these? Unlimited elemental energy. I mean, you don't see that every day. I don't know where he got these. Hopefully they are from a great source that will potentially give us a chance to pull something crazy. League of the Uniform Nomenclature, the Tiger Jet, Familiar Possess Hida. I have a Starlight Rare OCG of the new version. Uh, simultaneous Loss, W Wing Catapult. We have Dark Deal, very cool. Oja Magic. Infernal Incinerator, and oh, a 
water dragon super so it looks like these are legitimate packs that we're not gonna have to worry about being scaled or anything hopefully super rare water dragon look how beautiful that card is look how it hits the hollow that is a beautiful super rare ex gamer that's a good pull for you hopefully we can get some more as we go maybe from cybernetic revolution anybody anybody want to pull an ultimate rare ufo <laughs> ex gamer loves to like try and jinx me into pulling terrible cards so it would just be perfect karma if we pulled him a ufo roid it would be perfect so let's pull him an ultimate rare ufo roid let's go dragon's mirror tadpole pot of generosity we have poison and draw frog speaking of pot of generosity that's ex gamer steamroid mad lobster we have tyranno infinity and uh, dimension wall okay the dimension wall not too crazy let's try one of the lost millennium gx you don't get to open a lot of gx packs like this very often so this is pretty fun Make sure you guys thank EX Gamer in the comments. Let him know that he is a gamer. You may be able to find him uh, in the chat on YouTube and Twitch as well if you guys want to find him because he is pretty consistent around their area. We have the Ancient Gear Soldier, Gift of the Martyr, and... Oh, a mid-shield guard. I thought it might be an ulti for a second. Just a rare. That's okay. Still pretty cool. Okay, let's do the second Clash of Rebellions. And then we will go back to GX and the Cyber Dragon 10, which is all GX as well. So very cool stuff. Hopefully that Cyber Dragon 10, that's, this is actually a couple bucks, I think. The Zulkin. But yeah, hopefully that Cyber Dragon uh, 10 or the 10 promo comes out pretty clean. That would be pretty nice as well. Let's see. One, two, three. Can we pull a Ghost Rare or an ulti here? Balance of Judgment. There we go. Mystery Shell Dragon 2K 4 star. A little bit late, but he is existing there, being a very big guy. His Stilts Launcher, Esther. And Aroma Garden. We are still not pulling anything out of these. Maybe that means the other eight are really hot. So we're hoping that's the case. One, two, three. Before Mage Trick Clown, we have a Pianissimo, a DD Pandora, the Camelump, Aroma Jar, Silver Claw, not Silver Fang, Silver Claw. We have the Red Eyes. We have Aroma Age, Bergamot, and a Wavering Eye. Wow, 0 for 5 on these. Not doing so good with the core sets. By core set, I meant core set, because core sets would refer to all of these. Uh, core set, aka the abbreviation for this set. Trick Clown, come on. Pianissimo, we have a DD Pandora, Ignition, Keeper of the Shrine, Raptor Gust, we have Still Slosher, the uh, Sticky Steam Kaidru, and we got a super. It's a Fluffle Mouse. Okay. Fluffle Mouse, EX Gamer has been pulled right here. There he is. EX Gamer, good to see you. Fluffle Mouse is his uh, alter ego. Back to EEN, we did pull a Water Dragon last time. Let's see if we can get a Water Dragon ulti. That would be pretty sick. How about a Shining Phoenix Enforcer, though? That would, wait. Shining Flare Wingman. Sorry, wrong card. Shining Flare Wingman. That would be cool as well. Roll out. Hydra get on. Featherwind. Boss Rush. There we go. Infernal Incinerator. Level Modulation. Forces of Darkness. Ojo Muscle. And a King's Knight. That would also be a pretty cool ulti. King's Knight, Queen's Knight, Jack's Knight. Those are a pretty cool trio. Cybernetic Rev. Come on. Gotta believe in the GX packs that we can do this. Will we get an ultimate rare? Soitsu. There we go. Conscription. Jerry Beans Man. Jerry, a bean soldier. Believes he is the strongest warrior in the world, but his true abilities are still untested. Beautiful. Starmanek Cyclopean, Kurenai, Steamroid, Death Frog, Arrival Appears, and a System Down. Doesn't this destroy all, like, machine types or something? Yeah, remove from play all machine type monsters on the field. Yeah, pretty crazy. Sorry, machines. Ancient Gears, I'm talking to you. You guys are in trouble, and I also just dropped you. Ancient Gear Golem incoming right here. We are about to pull it. We are about to make it happen. Ancient Gear Golem. One, two, three, four. Can't we get something crazy? We have a Kamenate Blow, Guardian Statue, Battery Man Double A, Mind Golem, Elemental Hero Avian, Battery Charger, Area of the Water Charmer, Elemental Hero Burst into Tricks, and uh, Grave Oha. Okay, we're and Water Dragon's kind of the guy that we're like excited about right now. Should we open this 10 or should, we should probably save the 10 for a little bit later, right? Elemental Energy, come on. We need some good pulls for EX Gamer. Let's get him something crazy here for these packs that have been, so, I mean, Elemental Energy. I don't think we've ever pulled anything good out of Elemental Energy. I'm trying to think when we, we did, did we do a box break one time? I don't think we did. I think I just opened one, and I think it was not a great box. Asa, Nano Breaker, Featherwind, uh, Chitonian Alliance, Jazz, get your cards out of here. Let's try another TLM pack, and then we'll go to Cybernetic Revolution. Some good cards in here. Elemental Hero, Flame Wingman, the Ancient Gear Golem, one, two, three, four. Will it happen? We have the Lone Wolf, Lost Guardian, Asa, Kamenate Blow, Area, 
Burst in a tricks, minefield eruption, death wombat, and a DD survivor. Also would be a good rare, but we have one super so far. Maybe I spoke too soon. Maybe these aren't gonna have anything in them. I was feeling good right off the bat with that water dragon, but since then it has been pretty rough. Loose GX packs can be pretty hard to find, like legitimate. So I'm hoping he did, but I don't know where he got them from. But uh, GX is just so hard to find in general. Mad Lobster, Tyranno Infinity, Spiritual Fire Rod, Kuvenai, Arrival Appears, and a Spark Blaster. He be sparking. Okay, he's sparking it up. Let's go back to TLM. Let's try this again. I have hope for an Ultra Ancient Gear Golem. That'd be pretty sick. Do you guys remember the uh, Dark Magician Girl 10? You guys remember that? When it had an extra pack inside? And then it also had an Ancient Gear Golem first edition that got a 10 in it. That was insane. Duryata's Blessing. Avian, Rock Bombardment, and a Hero Signal. I'm waiting. I'm waiting patiently. I believe that we're going to pull something else crazy. All we need is one big Ultimate Rare, and it would make up for everything. We can do this. 4EX Gamer. we got to pull something crazy. We have Beige, Vanguard of Dark World, Boss Rush, Zhir, Familiar Possessed, Oxygenon, Familiar Possessed Area, Oja Muscle, Familiar Possessed Win, and... Oh! always think it's a foil chthonian alliance man another chaz card that we are not looking for crv you know what we're looking for we're looking for that cyber dragon that cyber in dragon ultra rare i mean ultimate rare would be crazy but i'm assuming these are retail i haven't been checking the code i probably should but i don't want to ruin it if they are retail i just want to believe that we have a hobby chance you know what i mean either way even un I mean, though unlimited is kind of weird so and if they're euro they don't seem euro but euro a lot of these GX sets, though, are only Euro Unlimited. I don't think it's these, though. Okay, Magical Explosion. Also a pretty cool Ultimate Rare. Okay, okay, okay. We might need uh, to open a 10 soon just to have a little excitement with that Cyber Dragon Secret Rare coming out. Bless us. I feel like I'm losing my voice right now mid-opening. Mid Monk Fighter, Kamenate Blow. That is a Ruxin Special win. Lost Guardian, Battery Changer. We have the Area, Elemental Herb, Sinatrix. Minefield Eruption and a Token Feastable. How many rares can we pull? Elemental Energy. I'm trying to think if we've ever gotten a good pull out of Elemental Energy. I don't think we have. I've graded a Water Dragon. I did not pull that though. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I've graded a couple cards, I think, but I have never pulled anything crazy. Whoa, actually we did pull, was it a Dark World card? Forces of Darkness, I think that's what we pulled, which wasn't bad. Oja Muscle. Infernal Incinerator, and we almost completely rucks and special this thing. Silver Warlord of Dark World. I feel like I pulled that unlimited or something like that. Okay, one more pack. Then we're going to go to the Cyber Dragon 10. We're going to pull Cyber Dragon right here. Then we're going to go to the Cyber Dragon 10. It's going to be sick. Xi'an Spy, Steam Gyroid, Spiritual Water Art, Aoi, Soitsu, Mad Lobster, Tyranno Infinity, Giant Kazaki, Doitsu, and Dimension Wall. It's, it's rare central. We've gotten one super so far. This is not great. EX Gamer, I'm sorry. I'm doing my best. Before we actually open this, let's take a look. You get two Cybernetic Revolution, one Elements of Energy, one Shot Infinity, one Enemy of Justice, and then a variant card, which is, you can see. So it's not very variant. Uh, this is the first launch. So they actually had, yeah, they show here. Neos, Cyber Dragon, Raviel, the first launch. Then they put Shining Flare, Wingman, Haman, and Uriah in the second launch. They had a little bit different packs, not super different. Very cool. Let's open it up. We've opened a few of these on the channel. I never really get tired of opening these old tins. It's really, really fun. All right, open it on up. We've got a Cyber Dragon inside. Let's see if I can get a nice one out of here. Let's go. We have a Cyber Dragon. It's got the plastic. We're hoping. Let's get a sleeve ready. Open this up. We have a Secret Rare. It looks pretty good on the front. Centering's pretty good. Okay, this thing looks pretty nice. A little tiny little scuff, but other than that, this is very good condition for a tin promo. Wow, it's beautiful too. Look at it. Okay, so we're not going to go completely over. We got the Cyber Dragon tin promo at least. It's very beautiful. So that's a good sign that that was in good condition. Now we got to get our packs out. All right, so we have two CRV, one Elements of Energy, one Enemy of Justice, and a Shadow of Infinity right there. So these are the tin packs. Keep that in mind as we go. So let's open one CRV from the tin and then we'll hop back into the other packs as well. Let's see if the tin, because it was sealed, so, you know, unweighed and everything. Thing. so maybe these will do a little better potentially one two three four soitsu we have a spiritual water art aoi drillroid cyber archfiend spiritual fire art we have a rival appear psychroid poison draw frog and another rare rising energy doesn't seem to matter right now we are just getting destroyed let's try Elemental energy. Let's turn it around. All we need is one big pack for EX Gamer. Let's go. Seem to be opening pretty normally, so they don't seem like they're like resealed or anything. From what I can tell, this would feel pretty normal. So that's good. One, two, three, four. Maybe we're just getting unlucky. I mean, unweighed, you know, 
a lot of GX boxes are mappable as well, so it's possible that could have happened. But then there's also just variants that you can sometimes just get unlucky. So there's all that. Oh, and there's a super. Yep, speaking of, it's just variants sometimes. So wait, we have a gold woo lord of dark world. There we go. Beautiful. So now we're, I love how this GX foiling, it just looks nice. It just, man, his whole body is golden. Very cool. Okay, so that's super nice. Let's try the Lost Millennium. This is the only set we have not pulled a foil out of yet. So we're hoping that this will be the one. TLM. So CRV, we've pulled one super, and then Elements of Energy, we've pulled one super as well. I, don't, I didn't count how many packs we had at the beginning. Uh, Lost Guardian, but it was probably like eight of each. Uh, it's probably like a booster box, basically. Battery Man, Shifting Shadows, we have Medusa, Final Return, Versinatrix, we have Pikaru, Ancient Gear Soldier, and... Uh, oh, a Millennium Scorpion. TLM is still letting us down. Let's go and try the Elements of Energy pack that we have over here. All unlimited, but still really cool. Can we get something big out of Elemental Energy? We have a Whirlwind Weasel. Very nice. Celestial Transformation. Chattered Axe. E emergency call, blazing heat, lots of heat does in GX. Icarus attack, very good card. A cheated heart, D shield, and oh, an ultimate rare D time. It is time for D, according to this card. I'm not saying that myself. Okay, we have a D time ultimate rare, probably one of the greatest Yu Gi Oh cards to ever be printed. It's just hilarious. D time, and it also got an ultimate rare. We got one out of the 10, so the 10 did have like some luck to it. That's pretty cool because it's about one in 12 to get an ultimate rare and we opened two packs and got one. D time, hilarious. EX Gamer, that fits you perfectly. All right, Lost Millennium, let's keep going. Insane, ultimate rare. If we can get one out of these loose packs, we really, if we had 24 packs, like the ratio is two ultimate rares, but for loose packs, it's probably not, you know, it's probably a little bit less like the Medusa. Lone Wolf, come on, Guardian Statue, Monk Fighter, Ruxin Special, Battery Man, cha Battery Changer, Area, Burst in a Tricks, Minefield Eruption, and Kazaki self-destruct button. That's the TLM trying to just blow themselves up right now. Ian, let's go. A bunch of supers out of these uh, packs on the left so far. So we're hoping that maybe there's an ultimate rare inside. Gateway to Dark World, roll out. I can't believe we got D time. That's so funny. Simultaneous loss. Force of Darkness, Wild Heart. He gave away a Wild Heart. He got one back. W Wing Catapult, Dark Deal, and... Brow, Huntsman of Dark World. That would also be a very nice ulti. At this point, almost anything would be a nice ulti. Oh, wait, there might be... Did I not open a CRV pack at one point? Because we have one extra, it seems like. I think I might have opened or skipped over CRV one time. I changed the order a little bit, so I probably did. We have a Jetroid. Come on, CRV. Tadpole, give us an ulti. Jetroid. Battery Man C. Was that two Jetroids? It was. Gyroid. Gyroid and Jetroid. Two Jetroids and a Gyroid, all in the same. Death Croaking. Doitsu. And we have a... Cyber Twin Dragon! Let's go! Super rare Cyber Twin Dragon. So we got some Cyber Dragons. Very, very nice. The background is electricity. I love it. Very awesome. So now we have three Supers and an ulti. If we can get an ultra, it'd be cool. It's 1 in 24 in GX though, so very hard. Or a lot of the GX packs. All right, SOI time. Will the, the pack that we've struggled with so much, SOI, will it have an ultra rare uh, Sacred Beast or an ulti? We have never pulled one in our lives. We've opened a lot of packs and never gotten one. One, two, three, four, let's go. We have Elemental Hero, Neo Bubble Man. Ancient Gear Factory, he has been known for uh, helping us pull stuff we'd never pulled. Grass Phantom, Attack Reflector Unit, we have Full Salvo, Beals Frog, Chain Thrasher, Tinkabito, Sheehan, and we have a Divine Dragon, Ectolion. We literally pull this every time we open Shadow of Infinity. Literally every time. It's a super though. We can't complain. This tin is actually two out of three. That's pretty good. All right, CRV. We have two more on this left side over here. Let's see if we can get something crazy. We got a Cyber Twin last time. That wasn't bad. This pack is going everywhere. One, two, three, four. Pot of Generosity. We got Shan Spy, Steam Gyroid, Spiritual Water Art, Aoi, Death Frog, Miyabi, Psychroid. We got a Steamroid and Rising Energy. I've seen you before today. Last TLM pack, and then we have two EEN and two Cybernetic Revolution. Let's go. Can we get EX Gamer something else awesome? One, two, three, four. We have Miss Polymerization, King of the Skull Servant, Mind Golem, Graveler, Gift the Martyr, I'm a Zero Clay Man. Final Ritual of the Ancients. We have a Moy Interceptor Cannon and uh, Millennium Scorpion. Those went over. That's okay. We're not, it's okay. It's fine. It's just. You know, it's just TLM. It's like, they're good, but if it's not hobby, it's not as interesting for those, you know, because compared to these, like, all the rares and stuff like that are all really good. So these are the ones we really care about, right? These are the ones we really care about. We have Dark World Lightning, Simultaneous Loss, Jethonium Palmer, Blade Skater, W Wing Catapult, Weed Out, Area, Wild Heart. 
Level limit area A. Not even the B, the good one. I guess, is A any good? Last one from the loose pack. So we ended up getting a bunch of supers over here, I think. Four supers or three supers. Not the best, like out of 24 packs. That seems a little, a little bad, but we can end it with a ultimate rare right here and ultimate rare. We have a steam gyroid. Pot of generosity, come on. Dragon's mirror. Jerry Bean's man. He believes he's the strongest warrior in the world, but his true abilities are still untested. Doitsu, Giant Kazaki, and feels like it should be in TLM. Oh, an ultimate rare, Dark Catapulter. And that is how you end off the loose packs right there. Another ultimate rare EX Gamer. It looks like those packs were legit. They just were terrible ratios. Dark Catapulter, ultimate rare. Let's go. That is beautiful. Check that card out. Wow, EX Gamer. Very nice. Congrats on the ultimate. Two ultimate rares and one opening. Not bad. And it's not over yet. Two more packs. Okay, we're going to save that CRV. Elements of energy. Here we go. Let's get a hero card or a cyber dragon in the next one or both how about both we have a rollout okay zero gateway branch weed out familiar possess area wild hearts infernal incinerator and uh, chthonium blast is that three of those that's not great and our final pack for ex gamer today there will be more episodes of the summer of ex gamer coming soon so shout out to him once again make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already there will be more epic content coming up in the future so hope you guys enjoy it one two three four let's end it off with a crazy pull for him dragon's mirror we have jerry beans man ah <sighs> he believes he's the strongest warrior in the world but his true abilities are still untested droid protect us all in death croaking Mechanical Hound, we have Doitsu, and a Cybernetic Magician. We are ending it off with a Super. Hey, three out of five and a 10, pretty crazy. Two Ultimate Rares, actually turned out way better than it started. Started off really rough. I was like, did he buy Wade Packs? Looks like he actually got some good cards. So thanks again, EX Gamer, for this awesome opening. Shout out to Tolan Fosho, Daxter, JT Cho, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, America Doidster, Supreme Sage 21, CJ, Leah Gwine 62, Another Tai Show, Ian Musa, Junior Barney, Mimic Gecko, and Robert F. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.